already know what I went to the gas station and got me. Some of these white chocolate Reese's. I'm telling you, if you ain't tried it, you need to give it a shot. They're absolutely delicious. You absolutely will not regret buying these. I've already had a few comments from some of you guys that actually listened and went and got some from the gas station. Y'all tell them, them things are the bomb. These are what, you'll never buy regular Reese's again. Never will you ever buy regular Reese's again. This is the bomb. Good morning, guys. Dude, I just caught the prettiest coyote I have ever, ever seen. This guy is beautiful. Look at the colors on him. What do y'all think about that right there? Dude, he is so beautiful. He's got like a lot of white, but like in blonde, but like black in that. Dude, he's gorgeous. What do y'all think? Do y'all think this is the prettiest one I've ever caught? Cause I really think it, dude, he is. I mean, just look at the color phases in that. Look how, how bright the inside of his leg is, the tan of the outside of his leg, darkness in his back, brightness in his face. Like that is just gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Dang. All right, well, I'm going to get this guy taken care of and um, then get the remake put in here. Y'all uh, y'all stay tuned because we <laughs> we got a lot more traps to trade. This is the first three traps in the morning. We got a bunch more. Oh, this is nice. Y'all, that makes the fourth, I don't lost count. See, your fourth, fifth, or sixth coyote off of this one intersection. I got that double punch hole set over there that I've caught. Believe it or I caught that one big old guy in over there in my double punch hole sets right here. But I've caught a bunch out of this freaking thing. This is like number four. This, this one right here just keeps wearing it out. But this is just one intersection. All this is is a three-way intersection. Roadbed goes back that way down the cutover. There's another roadbed that goes back this direction through the pines. And there's another roadbed that goes right down this way. It's just a big intersection. I've got to trap it every single one of the trails. Every one of them. All three of them. So uh, I'm going to get this remake in. Y'all don't go anywhere. I'll make this remake really quick because it seems like y'all don't like watching the remakes. If you do like watching remakes, drop a comment. But from what I've seen on the analytics, y'all do not enjoy watching remakes. So I'll make this one really quick, really snappy. Uh, set, hold, done, boom. Um, and uh, we're going to get on down the line and check some more tracks because I got a lot more to check. So hopefully we got some. Last night they moved good. A buddy of mine caught four in one day. So hey, it was a good night. Let's go get it. Let's get this taken care of and get on down the line and see what else we got. All right. Get this girl dug out in three, two. Kind of put the bait in there. And this we put high off the valley. Right there. And we put lightning in a bottle. Right there. And then some sheep's wool. Stick it all down there in the hole. Come on, you heifer. I dug that hole out. I know it's room to go down in there. That's a finished remake, and we got a few more traps to check. All right, some of y'all gonna think I'm weird for doing this, but I really don't care. The ones of you that do think it's weird or strange, I'm about to teach you something. Look at what this guy left us. These golden, golden 
Coyote scat. When you get some fresh coyote scat out of a cat circle, take it to an opposite farm that's not near where you caught where you caught this one at, and you will piss one of them darn things off. Like this guy was a male. So I got some male scat. I'm gonna take it to another farm. It's about 15, 20 minutes from here. Most likely we're gonna catch a big dog off of it because it's like a territorial dominance thing. And you'll, I'm telling you, you'll catch some big coyotes if you'll just transplant that scat to another set on a different farm. It works. If it's if you find some that's dried up on one farm, it doesn't have to be in a catch circle. If you find some that's dried up on a farm, take that scat to a different farm and put it there. I'm telling you, stuff works. Try it out. Let me know if it works for you. Let's get to the next farm check some more traps. All right, so I haven't had much uh, activity at this set since I caught the last coyote. So we're gonna take our transplanted scat and throw it right here next to the hole. Just like that, right there. Right next to the hole, boys. I'm telling you, if you've never done it, you need to do it. Try it out when you catch a big one. Send me a picture on Facebook, Instagram, whatever. Which reminds me, I made a uh, Facebook page. If you don't know, I haven't put it on my intro thing, but. You can find me on Facebook, Instagram, and YouTube now. So y'all go to Facebook, search up Carolina Coyote on Facebook under the pages section. It's not a, it's not an account, but it's uh, like a person's account. It's a, it's a page. So look in the page section on Facebook, Carolina Coyote. You'll find me. You'll see my logo. And uh, yeah, y'all check me out. Drop a like. Follow me there because I'm posting pictures and everything. So uh, let, let's get on down the line and uh, see what else we got. Oh my gosh, so freaking close. Look at this. Look how close that is. Man. Dang. <laughs> Sometimes you get them. A lot of times they'll get you. Man, a few more traps to check, y'all. Stay tuned. <laughs> Good morning, boys and girls. It is time to go check the trap line. And I really hope that we got something because it's a beautiful day and we've only got one more day of travel season left. That's it. That's it, just one more. It sucks, it really does. I only got to try out one month this year because of basically just life, you know? That's just how it happens. I met one of the guys, uh, one of the guys that watches my videos at the NWTF uh, banquet that I went to this past weekend. And he's like, man, I just ain't got time to. And I understand, that's how it was for me this year. Um, the only reason I got to try this month is because I switched jobs and I just took a month off, basically. So, uh, anyway, no friend. Hopefully we got tight chains, y'all. Let's find out. Dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it. Same place I caught it last yesterday. Got the bait out the hole. Remember how I couldn't get the bait stick all the way down there? I was like, oh, it's protected enough. They won't be able to get it without getting caught. Well, I didn't have my bait hole deep enough, y'all. I just didn't. Dang it. Man, that sucks. Man, that sucks. Oh, well, that's all right. We're gonna get it fixed up and Maybe he'll be back tonight again and uh, catch him there. Dang, could have been two nights in a row too. Game of inches, y'all, I'm telling you. It's a game of inches. We're almost to the second farm. I'm gonna eat a few of these and then we're gonna go get a coyote because I just got a feeling we got one. <laughs> 